What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading. Caps you side to everybody in between. Uh, don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Leave the rest. Free general collective reading. So it's very important. Only take the messages that resonate. Leave the rest. Sorry. Thought lights and wrinkles going off. Um, I received a channeling, so I'm on here. Um, I love you guys so much. I hope you can hear me. Can you hear me now? I hope you can. I've got the volume all the way turned up. I need to get a microphone. That'll be one of my goals um, probably probably this weekend. Um, I get my kids this weekend, so uh, we'll probably go shopping this weekend, and I'll get a microphone, okay? I do apologize um, for the voice issues. Um We'll try to make do until then, okay? Okay, so um, it's a good, really good message, just saying. So I hope everybody's doing well. I do. Um, thanks, everybody, for all the love and support to the channel. Let's see where we're at right now. Hold on. 13,125 subscribers. So thanks so much, you guys. I love and appreciate each and every one of you guys from the bottom of my heart chakra. Just saying. Okay. So um, we're just going to jump into it. It's a really great one. Just saying. Okay. So um, the channel message I received was um, someone is about to, I heard it. Okay. I heard gifts, gifts, gifts. And then I heard um, someone's about to receive an unexpected delivery at their front door soon. Um a box full of awesome clothes and a gift card is what I heard. A box full of awesome clothes and a gift card. Brand new. That's what I heard. Um, I hope I, whoever is about to receive this, I hope they know your size and your style because I, I don't know. I mean, everybody's different, but I would never send anybody a box of clothes, um, brand new or not, because you don't know if there's size has changed their style has changed i don't know that's at least for one of you guys i heard a box of clothes and a gift card um i would never do that i'm a gift card kind of girl i i send gift cards just to be safe if i give gifts i give gift cards um that's just me but everybody's different but at least one of you guys is going to receive a box of brand new clothes apparently and a gift card um, hopefully your style has not changed or your size. I just want to say that. Um, the other one I heard, um, someone is going to receive many gift cards soon. Um, so that's wonderful. Many gift cards. You plug it in, how it resonates. And soon someone that, um, someone that frauded someone and took their vehicle through many series of chain events, the vehicle is going to be repoed. Um, and they will be charged for, um, fraud. That's what I heard. So you plug it in, how it resonates. I mean, good and bad, good and bad. So a box of clothes and a gift card. Um, that's a wonderful, it's the idea that matters. So, I mean, I just hope your style and size has not changed is all I'm saying. Um, whoever that is for. Somebody's about to receive a lot of gift cards. So. However that resonates, that's beautiful. I think gift cards are wonderful gifts because that's what I do for gift giving. Um, because you just never know. You never know. It's the safest route to go and you know they can get whatever they want. And somebody, I heard that um, took a vehicle that basically was not theirs to take under fraudulent pretenses. I heard it's about to be repoed soon and they will be charged with fraud. So, um, wh whoever that's for, um, hopefully that's not for you. Hopefully it's somebody you're connected to. Um, you plug it in, how it resonates. Share my suggestion here for the collective. And I heard gifts, gifts, gifts too. So somebody's about to start receiving gifts, gifts, gifts. Now to me, that can go several ways. The gifts, gifts, gifts to me could be spiritual gifts or it can be physical gifts. You know what I'm saying? So all I heard was gifts, gifts, gifts really loud. So I, I don't know if that's physical gifts or um spiritual gifts to me that can go several ways 
Um, so you have to plug that particular message in, however it applies. One message may apply, two may apply, two plus may apply, none may apply. Only you know your specific story and situation, not anybody else. So you plug it in how it resonates, okay? Spare messages, you have to plug this. These are psychic intuitive messages, so it's very important only that the messages resonate with the rest. Um, love you guys. And if you think anyone else would like my channel, please uh, feel free to share my channel very publicly, social media, and word of mouth. I'm a single mom with two kids, so it really, really helps get my business out there, um, aka my business, my channel, and um, it helps um, support a single mom and to her kids. So I'm just saying. Spare messages you have to apply to. Bag, something important such as a new job or raise. So maybe one of you guys is about to get a new job or a raise. Um, and apparently some gifts. And I think one of you guys, um, I think you know the person that's about to get the vehicle repoed. The fraud person that's about to get the vehicle repoed. Um, there's a reason I'm pulling that in too. But I think it's somebody you know that has took that has taken a vehicle under Complete false pretenses. They knew they wasn't the person that was supposed to get the vehicle. And they're about to get repo. And I heard charged with fraud. So, I mean, it sounds like police are going to get involved. Um, or investigators or feds or somebody. Whoever. Uh, how, whoever handles that. Spirit messages you have reflected. And be, oh my God. You can't make this shit up even if you wanted to. I wasn't going to take the other two. I'll show you what we got. I wasn't going to take the other two, but when I had them flipped over like this, I heard take them. So I flipped them over. Boom, baby. It all goes together. Uh, wow. This is freaking beautiful, man. I wasn't planning on doing this reading, but yep, I'm here. So uh, just saying. Uh, I was going to go exercising, which I will here in a minute, and I have to say, I went and ate, a, I spent like, I never spend $10 at a fast food restaurant, I just never do, ever, never, but I did tonight, and it was one of the best damn uh, double cheeseburgers I've ever eaten in my life, and I've been really good on my food intake lately, and watching what I eat, but I really wanted a double cheeseburger, and buddy, I ate one, and it was so I haven't had a double cheeseburger in a long time. Just a single. But it was so good. And it was so thick. Oh, my God. Both patties. Give me a second. Okay. Bag something important, such as a new job or raise. Beetle good fortune. Dog protection from a powerful friend. Goldfish increase in material wealth or spiritual growth. I heard gifts, gifts, gifts. So, I think this, for some of you guys, it is spiritual gifts. I told you guys I thought it could be physical gifts or um, spiritual gifts. For one of you guys, I think it's spiritual. And I'm just being for real, for real. I heard take them. There's a reason I heard take these extra too because I almost did. Protection from a powerful friend. Increase in um, spiritual, and I'm sorry, increase in material wealth or spiritual growth. Somebody's about to get a new job or raise. And it's about to give you good fortune. And it's going to increase your material wealth. Some, I think it's going to increase your spiritual growth, your spiritual gifts. And somebody's being protected from uh, by a powerful friend. Let me see if I hear anything. Bag, something important such as a new job or raise. Confirmation thunder out there, by the way. There is complete chaos in a workplace situation right now. Complete. Someone is really, really, really blowing a position all to hell. Through many series of chain of events, they're about to be terminated. And then someone is about to get contact. The person that should have been in the position all along. 
Oh, Lord. So you plug it in how it resonates. Uh, okay. So, um, okay. So somebody is in a current position right now. Now, I feel this could be somebody you know or somebody you're dealing with. Um, possibly. Um, there's a reason I'm pulling it in. So um, I don't feel it's you. If this resonates for you. For some, it may be. But I, I feel for majority of you guys, it's not. It's somebody you know. Somebody got put in a position. And I'm feeling it's an important position. I, I do. I don't feel this is, you know, an entry-level position. I don't feel it's an entry-level. I don't feel it's a, oh, I'm just going to work summertime and blah, blah, blah. No. I feel this is a very important, like, position of high authority um, type position is what I'm feeling. Um, for a lot of these. For some, it might not be. But I'm feeling for a majority of these situations, it is. Um, because I heard they're blowing the position out of hell. So, I mean, there's something is like dumpster fire energy, basically. It, it, there, something's like a dumpster fire. And it sounds like it's happened since this person has been in this position. Definite position of high authority energy. Definite position of high authority energy. Okay, so it's definite position of high authority energy. So, okay, yeah. So, confirmation is position of authority. But anyway, so they have just blown it all to hell. They've blown it all to hell, like dumpster fire energy. Um, but I heard soon that person's going to be terminated. And through many series of chain events, the person that should have got the job all along is about to get a phone call. So that could be you or somebody you're connected to. I think you're protected from a powerful friend and it's going to give you good fortune um, that you're about to get this phone call. Um, because somebody is basically not, they're, they're not doing their job right or well or both. How that resonates. And I'm just being for real. Um, that's exactly what I feel. Frenzies, frenzies, frenzies. Frenzy. Oh, I heard frenzies, frenzies, frenzies. So they've got frenzies, frenzies, frenzies in there. Um, may, I, I think they're showing favoritism to people. And it's blowing it all to hell in some shape or fashion. Or it's um, some kind of abuse of power. And they're um, showing favoritism. I heard frenzies, frenzies, frenzies. So they're showing favoritism to their frenzies and not to other people, which is very discriminatory um, in a workplace. You plug it in, how it resonates. But I think it's about to work out well for you because I think, I think I'm pulling this message in because you are about to get the phone call. You're about to get the phone call um, for the job. I feel you were the one that should have had it all along because I heard the person that's about to get the phone call for the job should have had it all along so i think if this message applies for you you are the one that should have had it all along protection from a powerful friend good fortune so you're protected from a powerful friend and it's about to give you good fortune this phone call for this job if you want the job if you accept the position i mean for some you might have already moved on by them by now possibly for some you could be in different things uh different endeavors uh for some you could have moved i mean i don't know but if you choose to accept it, I guess I should say, kind of like, um, what's his name? James Bond. If you choose to accept the mission. Good fortune. You are about to get so many gifts so soon, so quickly, from all realms, very quickly. About to come quick and fast. Holy, this is such a good reading. You plug it in, how it resonates. You're about to get so many gifts so soon and qu so quickly coming all over the place, quick and fast, from all realms, I heard. So from all over the place, quick and fast, quick and fast, quick and fast, quick and fast. Good fortune, and somebody's, uh, I think one of you guys about to get offered a job that somebody else basically took that you, uh, it was meant for you all along, basically, but through many series of chain events, the other person got it, and, but now it's dumpster fire energy, and I think it's because they're playing favoritism to their friends, and whoever you are, I don't think you play favoritism in workplace situations, and I think whoever this person is, they know this, they know this, man. Um, that's exactly what I think. But you're about to start getting gifts all over the damn place. Um, good fortune. I mean, I heard gifts in here earlier. That's double confirmation with the good fortune. 
I mean, Lord. Protection from a powerful friend. Someone really knows the real truth. They're about to step up in a huge ass way. Someone really knows the real truth and they're about to step up in a huge ass way. So, um, you plug it in how it resonates. So someone really knows the truth. They're about to step up in a huge way. I think this is your protection from a powerful friend energy. Um, I think they've known the truth the whole time. I do. And I think they know they made a mistake. I think this person actually gave this person the job. Is what I think for some. I do. I think this person gave this person the job. Um, it might have been peer pressure. It might have been other reasons or factors. I'm not sure. But I think they knew deep down you should have had it. But they chose the other route. But now the route's blown up in their damn face. And so now it's backfired on them. So now they want to try to make it right. That's exactly what I think. But you plug it in how it resonates. But I heard someone knows the real truth. They know the real truth. And, um, and they're about to reveal it soon and quickly. And they're about to reveal it soon and quickly. So, um, your protection from a powerful friend knows the real truth. They're about to reveal it soon and quickly. Um, it, for some, I feel it could be the person that gave this person the job. For some, it could be somebody else um, that just knows the truth and they're about to reveal it quickly. However, that resonates. But you're protected. Whether you think you are or not, you are. Um, and whoever it is, it is a powerful person. Hopefully not an abuse of power. I don't feel this is an abuse of power kind of person. I mean, we all know there's people in the society and the world that abuse power. Trust me. Trust me. I've been a victim of four wrongful terminations in the universe. There's abuse of power all over the freaking place. And there's, ooh, I just spit. That's just the damn truth. But whoever this is, um, I don't feel it's an abuse of power in my way. So um, somebody knows the real truth. And they are a powerful person. And I think they are a positive person person in your life or they have been um is what i'm feeling and they're about to speak up on it soon and quickly whatever the truth is and how this resonates your protection from a powerful friend goldfish increase in material wealth or spiritual growth There are many, 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 many series of chain of events. Your finances are about to increase in huge ways. Okay, I heard through basically a shit ton of series of chain of events. Your finances are about to increase in huge ways. So um you plug it in however that resonates, if that resonates for you. Um how that resonates. Um, your finances are about to increase in huge ways through basically a shit ton of series of chain events. Um, whatever that is and how that applies, I should say. Um, how that resonates. Uh, for some, I do think this is increase in spiritual gifts. I just want to say that. I do think it's an increase in spiritual gifts for sure. I do. I do. For one, your clairvoyance is about to really kick in. Got sexual visions in the past. You're about to start getting completely different visions. Okay. Okay. So for, that happened to me. That happened to me. Whoever that's for, that happened to me. Um, I've gotten some clairvoyance visions in my life. Some, they were not sexual. But the beginning ones were sexual, and it just creeped the fuck out of me, to be honest. It creeped the fuck out of me. My first ever clairvoyant vision was somebody, a chick giving a dude a blowjob at, a, like, a house party. And I'm just being for real. Like, I hate to say it like that, but it's the truth. I did not want to see that. I did not want to see that. I did not want to see that. And I am just being serious. 
Um, I have gotten visions, clairvoyant visions of a wedding before. That was beautiful. But um, but whoever you are, your clairvoyant visions at first were sexual in nature too. Like kind of like my example. Um, but I heard they're about to increase. So they're about the spiritual visions are about to increase, but they're not going to be sexual this time, if that resonates for you. So um I did fill that in here. So you plug it in how it resonates, you guys. Well, okay. Um, thank goodness, because I understand how you feel, sir, ma'am, because I'm telling you, I was all new to the spiritual realm and spiritual gifts to begin with. Then when I get a freaking vision of a BJ, somebody giving somebody a BJ, that's not something I wanted to see. And I, I'm just being real. Um, so I understand how you feel. Um, I don't think you enjoyed that very much. I didn't hear you didn't, but I'm probably feeling you didn't. Uh, I know I didn't. So you... <laughs> You plug it in how it resonates. Somebody's sense of smell is about to come off the charts. Supernatural smelling ability. Someone's sense of smell is about to come off the chart. Supernatural smelling ability. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. Uh, I'm going to look up that um, term for the smelling one. Um, spiritual gift of smell. So we can all be on the same page here. I forget it every time. I think it's omnivoyance or something. I can't remember. Heard supernatural, supernatural gift of smell. Clairol faction. Clairol faction is what it's called. The gift of psychic smell. Distinct, distinctive smell perceptions have long been associated with a variety of psychic and supernatural phenomena. Um, wow. Okay, so somebody's about to get the clairol faction, the gift of psychic smell. I heard your smell is about to be a supernatural smelling ability, um, which is the clairol faction. I've only gotten that like maybe one time in my life. Um, and just saying. Um, but I heard it's about to be off the charts. Supernatural. So like basically like a dog. Super dog is what I'm feeling. It's like a super dog. Super nose. That's what I'm feeling. Holy crap. That's cool. I heard it's about to be off the charts. So, Clairol Faction. The gift of psychic smell. Yeah. Okay. Let me see if I have anything else. I hope you don't work in a uh, hospital or a nursing home. Just saying, just saying. Because, just saying. A Virgo feminine on the dark side, secret dark art spiritualist. She has been trying to hold a psychic back for many years, and she was successful with other people. But through many series of chain events, it is about to seriously backfire on her. Seriously. She is about to regret ever messing with this person. She's already performed a cord cutting ceremony on this person. Is about to keep backfiring on her in negative ways. She's hiding it from the public. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. So Virgo Fem, um, dark secret dark art spiritualist energy. Um, she could have Virgo in her sun, moon, rising, Venus, North Node, Ben Hammer, Jupiter charts. Um, she is a sounds like she's a very public secret dark art spiritualist. So 
if she's pu very public and she's a secret dark art spiritualist, I feel she'd be very public in the like public eye, like in the 3D or online. Um, I think she might be a pose as a light wise hot spiritualist is what I'm feeling for some of these Virgo fans. For some, they just could work in the 3D and playing their light side period, but they're really dark side. I heard they've already performed a cord cutting ceremony. Um, it sounds like on you, um, if this resonates for you, this message applies for you. Um, it sounds like she's already performed a cord cutting ceremony on you. So she wanted to keep you binded to her, which is dark arts all day long. But she's already performed it and it's already backfired. On you. So she wanted to, she performed the cord cutting to keep you binded to her, dark arts wise, energetically. She likes your energy or she did, but she wanted to release you energetically. She did. It's already backfired on her, but I heard it's going to continue to backfire on her. I heard she's been hiding it from the public. Soon it is about to be made known. People are about to pick up on it. Soon it's about to be made known. People are about to pick up on it. So soon it's about to be made known and people are about to pick up on it. Pick up on the fact that she had performed a cord cutting ceremony on you or that she had you binded in some kind of binding spell or attempted to bind you. Whoever this person is, she did bind you. She did. She did bind your ass, just let you know. But she's very skilled at this shit. But she doesn't want the public to know that she's that dark, basically. That she's that dark. So she puts on a different false mask, public false mask. Um that she's not that dark, but in reality she is. Um, but I heard soon people are about to start pick up, picking up on it. Um, and that could be a way it's about to backfire and otherwise, because I heard it's about to start backfiring on her in many ways. Um, backfiring in all directions, soon and quickly. Backfiring in all directions, soon and quickly is what I heard. So backfiring in all directions, soon and quickly. So it's about to backfire on her in all directions, soon and quickly. It's a Virgo fam. She's very skilled in dark arts. She's very freaking skilled, whether you know she is or not. Um, however this applies in your life. She could have Virgo in her sun, moon, rising, Venus, or them and having a different charts. I honestly think some of these Virgo fams are public light side spiritualists or readers on public platforms. For some, they could be out in 3D and you could work with them, live with them, be in the community with them, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. However, that resonates and applies. But they have been doing dark arts for a long ass minute and they are definitely in the public eye. Those are the two things they have in common, whether it's online or whether it's out in 3D. Okay? And they have Virgo in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or them in hand with Jupiter charts. But it's about to start, it already sounds like it's already started backfiring on them. But it's about to start backfiring hugely soon. It sounds like from all directions. Uh, but it sounds like it's about to benefit you in a huge way. But they, honestly, they should have never tried to um, bind your energy to them. They should have never done that shit to begin with. And that's just the truth. Leave people the head alone. Hashtag live free in the spiritual realm and in 3D. If anybody needs to hear that. Okay. I didn't hear anything else, you guys. I love you guys so very much. I hope everybody has a wonderful day, my dear. Oh, let me see if I hear anything else. Someone is about to have to move out of a home they didn't, were never supposed to live in to begin with. They're about to be pissed. Someone's about to have to move out of a home they never should have lived in to begin with. They're about to be pissed. So, you plug it in how it resonates. I love you guys. And I think that's going to be good fortune for you. Um, I don't think this is you. Um, you plug yourself in where you fit. But somebody's living in a home they shouldn't be living in. And I've been picking that up over the past week, too. So, how that resonates. I uh, love you guys. Namaste.